The Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment launched the Civil Society Platform for Social Protection, marking a significant milestone in the implementation of St. Lucia's National Social Protection Policy 2022-2030. The inaugural meeting held at the National Skills Development Centre brought together representatives from various non-governmental organisations, government officials and stakeholders in the social protection sector. The key discussion points included the structure and function of the social protection protection system, the implementation of the NSPP Action Plan, registration processes for civil society organizations, and the role of civil society in supporting vulnerable populations. Mr. Kendall Elver, Deputy Director of Social Transformation, emphasized the critical importance of this initiative. The Ministry of Equity says civil society organizations has been very important in the quest to achieve the mandate of protecting all St. Lucians from shocks such as uh, what we had during the, the COVID pandemic, um, shocks that you experience throughout your life if somebody becomes unemployed, if somebody falls into poverty. Uh, the Ministry of Equity recognizes that various civil society organizations are contributing towards this very important process. The Civil Society Platform aims to provide a formal mechanism for civil society organizations and beneficiaries to participate in shaping social protection policies and programs in St. Lucia. This collaborative approach is expected to enhance the effectiveness and reach of social protection initiatives across the island. Participating organizations were invited to join the Social Protection Network and support key initiatives such as the Kudme Setlisi Program, spearheaded by the St. Lucia Social Development Fund, SSDF. Executive Director of the St. Lucia Social Development Fund, John Victorin, emphasizes that commitment from all stakeholders is essential to ensure the platform's sustainability. There is a reason why there's a profound belief that if we are going to make an impact, we need to work together. We need to work together. This forum is absolutely, absolutely integral in our effort to provide social protection. While social protection broadly embraces the entire society, it targets the most vulnerable. The ministry is moving apace to engage and collaborate within the SPN to mainstream social protection and will be rolling out an information campaign to highlight the latest developments in the social protection sector. This platform launch represents a crucial step in St. Lucia's ongoing efforts to strengthen its social protection framework and better serve the needs of its most vulnerable citizens. From the Ministry of Equity, Social Justice and Empowerment, Anisia Antoine.